So as I've said the last couple of weeks, I've been having trouble with the memory card in my camera. Now the memory card that I use is a micro SD card. If you don't know what a micro SD card, it's basically an SD card, but it's really, really small. It's about the size of a fingernail, but it holds, I think, 128 gigabytes, which is a lot because technology is amazing these days. The fact that they can make something so small that holds that much information is incredible. But in order to put the micro SD card in my camera, I need to use a micro SD adapter, which is what this is. This, you, this is the size of a regular SD card, and then you slide the micro SD card in here, and then you can put it in devices that use SD cards. So while troubleshooting what is wrong with the SD card, I ended up buying a new adapter. That's This is the old adapter that was in there, and so hopefully that is the problem, because to replace this cost $3.50. Whereas to replace the micro SD card itself, that's like over $100. So if it ends up being this, hopefully it ends up being the micro SD card. Because if it's not that, then it's the camera. And the camera, who knows how much that would cost to fix. So keep your fingers crossed that it was the adapter. And with that, let's go ahead and roll the thing. Hey guys, Sean here. So once again, I am waiting until the very last minute to make this video. In fact, it's 2.42, so this might be the most last minute that I've ever waited to make a video. I believe though that the timeline works out to where if, as long as I have everything shot by four o'clock and then from two to six, everything can get edited because I think six o'clock is the cutoff in order to start uploading it because if it should take two hours to upload, then it will be done by 8 o'clock. So why have I waited so long to make this video? Well, let's do a little week-long recap to see what went wrong. Last Sunday, I probably could have made a video for this week. Did I? No. I don't really remember what I did, but it was pretty much nothing. Monday nights, I really don't have anything that I normally do, which you'll see what I mean by that as we go through the week. However, this past Monday, two of my co-workers' contracts came up, and so they can't work again for three months because of crazy California laws, and so we had to go to the bar and do the typical hey, so long for now sort of bar things. I don't know what you call them. Anyway, I was at a bar until really late on Monday and I don't drink. Now on Tuesday, I've been doing the same thing every single week since the beginning of the year. Hey, so speaking of memory cards, it is at this point that the memory card in my audio recorder ended up getting filled. So pretty much for the remainder of this video, the audio is going to be coming from the camera and not the audio recorder and the lavalier mic. It will, however, pick back up at the very end because that's when I noticed that the card was full because I'm an idiot. So I just wanted to put this little thing in here so you're not too thrown off by the drastic audio change. Anyway, back to the video. I would come home, I would watch Tox Machina on Geek and Sundry's Twitch channel, which you don't know what Tox Machina is, most likely, but you will in about two weeks if my scheduling and video making works out the way that I am planning for it to work out. And then I would watch a movie in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, and then I would watch the kind of funny MCU in review of said movie that I just watched. And I have done that every single week for, I guess it's the last 16 weeks? It was, of course, all leading up to Avengers Infinity War, which, if you've paid any attention to entertainment news at all in the last week, you know that came out last weekend and was the highest grossing movie ever to be released opening weekend. That's not the right way you say that. What is the right way you say that? The highest grossing opening weekend for a movie ever. There we go. So for that reason, I didn't have to watch a Marvel Cinematic Universe movie because I had watched all 19 since the beginning of the year. However, this last Tuesday, I had to stay a little late for work, and once it reaches a certain point, it's better to just watch Tox Machina there instead of getting home to watch it because I would never be able to get home in time to watch it since it's at 7, and generally I get off work at 5.30, and I barely just make it every single time because traffic in Southern California is the worst in the world. 
Look it up, there's plenty of studies. So for that reason on Tuesday, I ended up getting home late as well. Now on Wednesdays, I stay late at work to play a tabletop RPG called Battle Stations. This is a Dungeons & Dragons-esque tabletop RPG that revolves around space and space travel and all that sort of stuff. If you don't know what Dungeons & Dragons is, well, next week, again, if I follow on the schedule that I am hoping to follow on, you'll learn all about Dungeons & Dragons. And so that ended up going until like 9.30, so I got home late again that day. Now on Thursdays, I will go to the headquarters of my company, and depending on which week it is, there is an event that happens there. One week it'll be a tabletop gaming week, and then the next week it'll be a video gaming week, and then it switches back and forth between the two. This week it was the tabletop gaming week. However, there is something else that happens on Thursdays now, and once again, if staying on schedule, you'll learn all about that in two weeks. I am a little distracted right now because one of my favorite Twitch streamers, Elspeth Eastman, is currently streaming on Twitch and I have the channel up in the corner and she just started playing a game that when she plays it, she plays it with her followers and, you know, whatever you call Twitch people, Twitch fans, whatever. And generally, if I'm home and available, I will jump in on that. And I can't do that right now because I'm making this video. See, this is the punishment of waiting so long to make this video. This is my punishment. Because by the time I get this all shot and edited and uploaded, she'll be long done because she's on the East Coast, so it's already 5.57 there. Curse you, procrastination! And the only thing that's gonna sting more is when I talk about Friday, because what happened on Friday? Nothing. I didn't really do anything on Friday. Well, no, okay, no, I didn't do nothing. I had to go get gas, and then I had to go to Target because I needed new sunglasses because my sunglasses have been broken for like two weeks and I haven't had a chance to go get new sunglasses. And then I needed some other stuff at Target. And then I got home. And then I was just too burned out from the rest of the week to actually think about doing anything as far as a video is concerned. Although I did better set up the overhead camera on my streaming setup, so that should be almost ready to actually be used for something one of these days, so fingers crossed on that. And then that leads us to today. Today, why did I wait till 2, well, 2.59 now to do this? Well, I was very exhausted this morning, and I didn't get up till much, much later than I originally intended. And then on top of all of that, every Saturday and Sunday, basically, I need to get caught up on the Kinda Funny Morning Show and Kinda Funny Games Daily Show. You see, Kinda Funny does an hour-long morning show every single day on Twitch, and then they do an hour-long video game show every single day after the morning show on Twitch. And whatever I haven't watched during the week, I need to then watch on Saturday because I'm insane. And so far, I think I'm halfway through Tuesday. So that's seven more hours of content I need to watch, and then on top of that, I need to watch Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. from last night, and then I think I have to watch Supergirl, Arrow, and The Flash from the last two weeks because I didn't watch any of them last week. Oh, to be fair, I did finish season six of Night Court during this week. I don't remember which night it was, but I did do that. So that is part of the problem of modern life. There's just too much content being created. And as someone who loves created content, it's hard to find time for everything. I think back to about 11 years ago, it was before I moved to California, and I remember I was able to play like all the games that I wanted and watch all the things that I wanted, and I was always caught up on everything that I wanted. And nowadays it just seems like I'm always way, way, way behind on everything, and I don't know what changed. But what I think it is, is that there's just so much more. I can't even begin to tell you how far behind I am on YouTube subscriptions and like the videos that they've uploaded and I haven't seen yet. So I've said it before and I'll say it again, if everyone could just take like a year off from making content, that's TV shows and movies and YouTube videos and Twitch streamers and just everything, if you could just take a year off, that'd be really great. Oh, podcasts too. Oh, jeez, podcasts. I currently have a playlist on my phone that is like, I think at 198 podcasts. It's finally reached the point where I've started listening to all of them 
at two times speed. And for the first time, it's actually starting to make a dent in it because that's how often the podcasts I listen to update because I've been stuck at like 204 for the last like year probably. And I've been listening at 1.5 speed. But it doesn't help that the only time I listen to podcasts is in my car. So that's another part of it. And on top of that, there's comic books too. I'm way behind on comic books as well. And then just regular books. I've been reading Carrie Keegan's autobiography for about a year now because I just never find time for any of these things because of all the other things that I'm cramming my brain with. So let me know down in the comments below if there's anything that you're currently just obsessed with that's taking up all of your time entertainment wise or if there's something that you wish would just go away for a little while so you could get caught up on other things or you know just something that makes sense in what I'm trying to say feel free down below in the comments let me know and while you're down there if you liked this video go ahead and hit the like button and if you'd like to see more of the crazy crap that goes on around here go ahead and hit the subscribe button and if you'd like to help support the crazy crap that goes on around here go ahead and hit up my patreon and with that have a good however long it is until you watch my next video